If a professional is telling me, I gotta work on this, it's like, okay, I'll work on that. Having gone to art school and doing critique sessions helped me kind of build that thick skin. I got some, some great reviews and I got some bad reviews. And nowadays when people ask me for advice about, you know, how do you handle portfolio reviews, I tell them, don't just listen to the bad stuff, pay attention to what they like so you can continue to do that. And that's one of the things that I that was able to focus on because my portfolio reviews were critique the pencils, critique the inks, hey, I really like your colors. It took me a while to clue in the fact that they had nothing to say about it other than like, hey, that's really great stuff. Because Gregory Wright, who was looking through my portfolio, he's like, there's no reason why you shouldn't be working in comics right now as a colorist. That's what I'm like, ugh, oh, yeah, I'm such an idiot.